Uh, my name is Adam Melvin. I'm an assistant professor in the Kane Department of Chemical Engineering. So my research uh, deals with developing new techniques and technologies to study protein expression and cellular behavior in single cells. Uh, in the past decade or so, researchers have found out that studying single cells yields much more information than studying populations of cells, mostly because two individual cells are not alike, analogous to how two people are not alike. And so I have two ongoing research projects right now. Uh, the first is more related to cancer diagnostics, where we're developing uh, cell permeable uh, protein biosensors, which we can incorporate into individual cells and then measure the activity in a high throughput manner using a microfluidic device. Uh, this has large scale implications for clinical diagnostics, uh, drug development. I have another project where we're developing another microfluidic device to study the growth and migration behaviors of algae uh, in response to singular combinations of environmental factors such as light, temperature, and salinity. This has a lot of implications with energy and the environment, either as algal biofuels or understanding what causes harmful algae blooms to form. Well, cancer is prevalent in the lives of almost everyone nowadays. Um, everyone either has someone related to them or has a friend that has been diagnosed with cancer or is being treated for cancer. And so there's a lot of limitations in both the diagnosis and the treatment, and a lot of that's technologically dependent. And so if we can come up with new technologies, that will then help uh, the population of Louisiana as well as the U.S. and the world. Now in terms of algae, uh, Louisiana is probably the best state suited for algal biofuels because of the large marshlands that we can use to grow up algae and cultivate them. And then being this close to the Gulf of Mexico, harmful algae blooms and red tides, that, those all have significant environmental and uh, recreational impacts.